Hi everyone, I'm Tanishka from Class 6 of Shisha BML Public School and today I'm going to show you how can you make a doodling app on App Inventor also known as Code to Play. So you need to first of all start a new project and I'm going to name it as Let's Doodle. So in this app we will first have a screen on which we have a button to start and then after that we have another screen on which you can just doodle so first screen so here you can just go down and the first screen title you can put it as let's doodle so let's okay here we have it let's doodle the screen one on this first you just need to drag a button and a label above the button actually and the label text again needs to be changed to let's doodle and then you can change more properties such as the background color and of course you can increase the size so i change the width so it becomes big and height you can change it to around 20% 20% that's 20% of the screen text size 30 or 50 depending on your choice and what else you can do so that it looks even better is you can change the text alignment to center so this was the part and you can also change the text color which I'll be changing to green or gray, gray. this was first and the button needs to be named as start or let's start and then and then you can just click on the screen here in this here align horizontal it needs to be center and again this in the center you can also change the background color of the screen to your desired color this was a screen one now you just need to add a screen and you, you can leave the screen name as screen to itself. So in screen 2 we will just need a canvas and an accelerometer sensor. So here's the screen. First you need a canvas from the drawings and animation. You drag and drop a canvas. You change the height and width. So the height is supposed to be fill parent as well as the width is supposed to be fill parent here it's here you can change the background color so that it looks good so i'll be changing it to green and you can also add an image in the background so that you can doodle on it this is the canvas now from the sensor drawer you need to drag and drop an accelerometer sensor. This is all we require here. You can draw on it because it's a canvas. So again, you have got to go to screen one and then to the blocks interface. And here you just have one button that's required of programming. So when button one dot click, it should go to it should open another screen. So when you scroll down in the controls, you find open another screen screen name then from the text drawer you need to bring a blank one and name it as screen 2 or if you have renamed the screen 2 there open another screen screen name screen 2 then again you need to go to screen 2 and then when you go to screen 2 from there you open the canvas drawer 
you take one canvas one got dragged then again from the canvas you when you scroll down you find and canvas one draw draw line and you put it inside this and then when you click on it you get get previous x get previous y get current x you can do any freehand drawing onto this app so if i want to draw a circle for instance i just need to drag my finger over it and it will draw it